Hi everyone, I want to go over your video presentation um, that is a required part of English 112. Make sure you feel comfortable with it. I do want to say that this is a state requirement that we have some form of an oral presentation so we can't get around it, but I am trying to make it as low stress as possible for you. So in my English 112 class, the way I have you do your presentation is I'm tying it into your social sciences um, literature review. So you're going to keep the same topic as your social sciences. I'm just asking you to go a little bit further. You have this as assignment sheet available in the rubric, so I'm not going to read all of it, but I want to hit the big points. Basically, I want you to do a two to four minute presentation in which you're going to do a very brief review of your research. So take your whole essay and condense it down into like maybe a minute review of here's my three big points kind of thing. Um, reviewing, okay, this was my research question. This is what it says. The rest of it, so the other couple minutes, should be about how you want to further your research. You are presenting to a board of directors, so while I'm not going to require you to dress up for your video, you're more than welcome to, look professional if you'd like, but you do need to sound professional and polish and organized. Remember who your audience is. You want to convince the board of directors to give you money for furthering this research. So based off what your research question is, what you found through your literature review, how do you want to go further in your research? I've had students say they're going to conduct focus groups, do surveys, observations, um, and I just want you to give me a rough estimate of how much that might cost. I don't expect you to give me an exact breakdown, but if you know that you want to do a survey in um, 100 schools in North Carolina, well, let's say, you know, and you want to pay participants, well, each survey, I mean, sorry, focus group, each person in the focus group is going to get paid $20 plus free food. Well, each focus group is 10 people, so there's $200. Food's probably going to cost me another $100 or so, so I need $300 per focus group times that by 100. There's my cost of that, and this is what I want to pay people. So I'm just looking for like a very rough estimate of, hey, this is what I want to, the money I need, and this is what I'm going to use it for and why. So how is your research going to further this ongoing research and what do you want to find out from it. You do met, we'll see peer ratings. We're not doing that because we're not meeting face to face. It's just included on the assignment so you can ignore that. Your rubric, I've made it as straightforward as possible. Some of these requirements are a departmental requirement. Some of them are for me. Um, I'm really going to be looking at, are you persuasive? Do I, like, do you give me a good reason to give you this money? Um, is your background brief but detailed so you're not spending two-thirds of your presentation on your background, but it's enough detail that I understand what you mean. Your vocal rate, can I hear you? Are you lacking the use of um, uh, like? That's where you do want to practice this. Um, audience feedback and response, obviously, I, I can't do much with that. Now, audience response, that's going to be easy. Like if you are monotone, you're not very engaging, like that might impact it to developing. But since this is a video, I will keep that in mind. You don't have an audience outside of me and your video camera. Um, eye contact, are you looking at the camera? Are you occasionally having a glance at your notes, but mainly looking at the camera, or are you just reading from your notes as you go? One of the questions I get asked a lot is, do I have to have a PowerPoint? You do not have to have a PowerPoint. You can choose to have one, but it is not a requirement. Whatever is going to be easiest for you. In the directions on Blackboard, I've told you how you can make an unlisted video. Um, to be able to share a YouTube link with me, but if you don't want to do an unlisted YouTube video, you do need to email me and I'll provide you a Google Drive link that you can upload your video to. Um, but make sure you ask for that at least 25 hours in advance of the due date so that way I have time to give it to you. If you have questions about the presentation, just let me know.